So one of the stable, one of the best performance based Android 12 based custom rooms are for the Redmi Note 10 Pro or Pro Max users. Pixel extended based on Android 12 is absolutely good and I'm using from past 48 hours almost and quite satisfied with this, this one. Let's find some things which we have in this build. The version which I'm talking about here right now is Pixel Extended version 4.2 based on Android version 12. All the Android 12 features including the new ones like app lock, face lock, everything is almost present here including some bit of features etc. This room might be a quite good choice for you if you want to install something interesting on a device with good stability and performance, Phantom kernel is what you get pre-installed. Let's move on quickly to the first default things here. For example, the default launcher, what we have. Default launcher as this is a Pixel extended custom room. So it was expected that we might get the Pixel launcher pre-installed. So as available in this one, launcher launcher, you can install that if you want some customizations in your default launcher, it's up to you. Including that, if you move on to the quick settings panel, one thing keep in mind, you have the white background. So yes, it is not customized. It is by default. In some rooms, for example, default Pixel experience or Pixel OS, you have the black background well like the stock one but in this one we have the white background behind the quick settings panel which you can customize with the help of some magic modules if you want to if you click here you will be entered into the quick settings panel and talking about some other things for example the power menu it's also same with the white background other things are kind of same it might be a very interesting thing in quick settings panel too you can customize this thing if you want to it's up to you you have magic modules available to customize these things on your device if you take a look at the app opening and app closing speed, the multitasking speed, I think so I found this room quite smooth. Yes, a lot, a lot of custom rooms I've tried so far in Redmi Note 10 Pro also. You can see the smoothness, it's definitely smooth. There might be some other custom rooms also, but I'm talking about my experiences about the Pixel Extended Room. If you want to take a look at the L1 certificate, if it is here or not, for example, if you want to use Amazon Prime or Netflix, etc. L1 is here. I haven't installed any kind of firmware to get this L1 certificate. It's available for me by default whenever I install this room for the first time on my device. So I think so. It might be a plus point about this one. The default camera which you get here is the normal snap camera which you have in all the AOSP based kind of rooms. It's not the MIUI camera, it's not ANX camera, it's not Gcam, it's not Google camera, Go Edition, it's the normal default camera. But if you want to install Gcam on your device, you can. In my case, Gcam is just working perfectly fine here. The Gcam I'm using here, I've already shared with you some time ago on my cloud channel. So make sure to check out that if you want to install this Gcam on a device, which is working perfectly fine, I think. So no major issues is what I got so far after installing this. Looking for the safety net status here, let's find out some things. For example, let I try this app, always use this app, for example, yet another safety net attestation checker and safety net status has no issues. I have rooted my device with the help of Magisk, but yes, it's good. It was also expected and yes, we have the unlimited backup for the Google Photo in the Google Photos for the full resolution photos and videos uploaded from this device. That feels absolutely good. Full resolution, no storage saver quality. It's full quality, but you need to update the Google Photos app to the latest version to get this thing on your device. Moving on to the settings options, you can see snow house where we have some customizations or features as expectedly. Other things are just kind of same like no Xiaomi parts, but of course we have the device specific things included in the system. But other thing other than else, everything is almost same like the stock pixel, which you get in all the Android 12 base rooms, etc. This is not a big deal. Of course, this pixel extended, not a customizable room. You also have the game dashboard pre-included in this one. For example, if you want to take a look at the game dashboard, in some custom homes, we might not face this, but in this one, we have the option available. If you want to use this gaming dashboard, it's available for you. Talking about the battery backup, as I'm using it from past 48 hours probably, and the battery backup seems to be decent enough. It's not one of the best one, but it's not worth it. It's not bad, sorry, it's not worst, it's not bad. It's absolutely good. Overnight, I got 1% of drain, which is absolutely fine. And other than else, it's looking quite good. If you move on to some other things, for example, the display settings, let me tell you one thing. If you move on here and check out any other features, we have the font at sector options available. And in dark theme, we don't have the pitch black option available, pitch black color. Unfortunately, it's not present there. 
But other than else, you have the icon shape options available. We have the icon pack related options available for you. If you want to customize these things, you can. And as expectedly, face lock, fingerprint lock, everything is present. You can see security, etc. Things. If you move on to the security tab, you have the screen lock, face lock, fingerprint lock, etc. It's already present here. If you want to take a look at this, I tried enabling the fingerprint and face unlock both there, but app lock is not there. I tried founding, I tried checking out, but it was not present there, unfortunately. But face lock and fingerprint lock is there. So if you need face unlock, that's there. And for other things, you can try out this thing and try it on your device. This is all. Goodbye. Over the edge, feel like I'm floating through the air.